And Miss Turner, I believe this is yours. Please, look inside. Oh, hello, Lottie. Blah wasn't the only one who could change form. I am also an animagus. Wherever there was a butterfly, there I was. I had to keep my presence in portrait secret, for it would have tipped off Bly and put you in danger. Don't leave again. I have so much to tell you. Every time you paint, I'll be there. Especially with the family brush. I get to keep the brush? Of course you do. It's my gift to you. It's a Turner family tradition. Only the most clever, determined, and imaginative painters in the family ever find it. That's the most important part of the challenge. To ask for help and not be blinded by treasure. The brush is only bestowed on those who can extend the Turner family to others through their art and kindness and friendship. It holds great power, yours. Thank you, Father. I promise to paint with this every day, just like we used to. Hey, what are you up to? Lottie was just telling us about the first time she apparated. Technically, she didn't apparate. Her dad did. And it's called Side Along Apparition. Yeah, thanks for the magic lesson, Kev. Now, let Lottie get back to her story. It was just getting good. Where was I? Oh yes, we planned a lovely day of painting at the Swedish Dragon Reserve. Oh, I've heard that place is magnificent. Oh, sorry. Continue. Since we didn't have much time, Dad said we could apparate there and back. I was a bit nervous, but I took his arm like he showed me and then poof! We apparated. Was it absolutely brilliant? No, it was awful. First, everything went black. Then, it felt like I was being squished. Then, squished some more. I could hardly breathe. I suppose it takes some getting used to. I think I'll stick to traveling by broom. I prefer the flu network. The safest way to travel, in my opinion. I don't know. The side along apparition sounds scary. But it could be fun. Just think how fast you could get places. Apparition. 
Side along apparition. Side along apparition. Side along apparition. Side along apparition. Side along apparition. Side along apparition. So how was painting in the reserve? I hope it made operating worth it. We didn't get the chance. Turns out the annual broom race was going on. How did you not know that before you went? It's one of the most famous broom races around. My mom's competed in that race. She hasn't won yet, but she says it's a blast. The trophy is wicked. It looks like a dragon. <laughs> But Lottie was telling a story? Oh, right. Sorry. Go ahead. Well, since the race was going on, which cuts through the Dragon Reserve, the Short Snouts were already a bit grumpy. They charged us the second we appeared. That must have been terrifying. Very. But they were so beautiful. Silvery blue and majestic. I really do wish I could have painted them. Obviously, you got away. But how? Before they could fry us with their dragon breath, Dad grabbed me and we disappeared. You got very lucky. Short snouts could turn you into ash in seconds if they were so inclined. And they usually are. Apparition is a smart choice when dealing with dragons. Or any other enemy. A speedy retreat. Now that's a sound battle plan. Okay, nearly there. Could you grab me five bottles of powdered dragon claw and four frog brains? Just in time. Now it just needs to simmer for a while. You go rest. I'll see you before class tomorrow morning. Here's your potion, Robin. It took all night, but it's done. Thank you! I feel smarter already! This might be your best tasting potion yet. It tastes just like fresh pumpkin juice. I'm surprised to see you here so early, Robin. But wait. What did you just drink? Huh? Nothing. It was just pumpkin juice, I swear. <laughs> now come on, we have a quiz to ace. I don't think I've ever seen you so excited for an exam. But yes, let's go. <sighs> what? Don't look at me like that. Robin's got this. Right, students, let's begin today's exam. I hope you all studied hard.
right, students? Let's begin. I hope you all studied hard. That's the end of today's exam. Don't forget your homework. about the International Confederation of Warlocks Statue of Secrecy last week. Wait. No. You wouldn't, would you? What was that potion you drank before class? What? what? I don't know what you're talking about. It, it, was, it was just pumpkin juice. You stammer when you're nervous. I know you're hiding something. Actually, she is. It was just pumpkin juice. I... what? I thought... You mean, it wasn't Borofio's brain, Alexa? But I felt so enlightened! That's because you thought you drank it. It gave you confidence in your own abilities. And you did a lot of studying last night. See? You didn't need a potion after all. Fine, Merlin, I did it! I told you that you just needed to study. I know, I know. You were right. Speaking of, let's go finish that history of magic assignment before the potion wears off. I mean, before my enthusiasm runs out. Thanks for helping, you two. You nearly fooled me there. Sorry, I didn't want to lie, but you're not the best at acting, and we needed her to believe she'd taken the real elixir. Also, I did actually prove Baratheon's brain elixir, and since you helped, I figured you should keep it. Really? Thank you. Though I don't think I'll be using it. Hard work is clearly more effective than any potion. Right you are. But you never know when it might come in handy, so long as it's not for any exams. 